watching you. We love you. Yeah. We love you. Just You're watching you just bunch. chat. You're such a lovely lot. Yeah. You really are. You are part of our family and we yeah. really do feel that. And we love so. the way you look out for each other. Cheers, everybody. Cheers. I've got a coffee. Mark, I've let Mark have four dates because I'm having a glass of wine. Huh? You've had four dates. I've had four dates. There may be a knock at the door because we're having a little bit of a takeout just to enjoy. Um, so. Uh, 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 right. So how are we all? <laughs> Got a date for them. Now, I know a number of you thought I was giving birth. He is, very soon. <sighs> but that's not an announcement. I know some of you thought I was going to get down on bended knee. Miss Sawala, I'd like to take you. I'd just like to take you. Hold my hand. <laughs> just like to take you, and basically. And we're halfway there. Somehow, some way. No, nope, Pete's not doing that. Not doing that either. Some of you thought that Nanny Die was moving in. Yeah, that was a good one. I like that one. Ashley thought we were getting divorced. Ashley. We felt like your parents that you were worrying we were yeah, going to get Yeah, don't divorced. fret. We would never announce that. We'd just do it. <laughs> You'd just be, there would be um, tumbleweed on the channel. I love that, you know what, all the guesses that come out were so wonderful because they're all things that we've talked about and talked about, like adoption. I still can't get him to agree on that. Going so on that a camper would be really van nice. tour. Well, the camper van tour. Gogglebox. Gogglebox. Um, marriage Renewed, Naked Attraction, Gogglebox, uh, um, I know Claire Ross Reed, awful, major incident. Dawson radio horrible. show, a number of people thought it was a radio show. Radio show. Could still be in the offing. The funny thing is. Could be still in the offing. Quite a few of these things that you're guessing, hmm. we can't say what, there are conversations happening. Oh yeah. So maybe... The next time we say we've got a big announcement, you can remember that I've said that and then yeah. you can refer back to this and think, do you remember when yeah. they said... Da, 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 Some da. of you have got a little whiff of things. A little a whiff. Whifter. Just a little whifter. But nobody's got a whiff of the final... Well, I've got a whiff of you. ...thing that we're going to tell you at the end of this live. No. Nobody has guessed it. No. No one's guessed it. No one's guessed what we're ultimately doing. But people have got close to guessing what it is we're trying to say. What do you think it might be? What do you think it is, Nads? TV show? Do we need a TV show? I don't really feel like we need a TV show. You know, show. the thing is, it's interesting how many of you say to us... Merchandise? Oh, have, no merchandise. How you should have your own uh, reality show. But we have. It's called The Vlogs. And it's just for you guys. Yeah, we much prefer it's it. It's not for all those people out in telly land. Yeah. It's just for you lot. Yeah. Because let's face it, if it was done for telly, there'd be all those people trying to make sure it was really banal and bland and we didn't say anything exciting or contentious. It's amazing how many things that are going up there have been discussions about. Yeah. But that's other exciting things to talk to you about. A bit further down the line. Absolutely. Toffee's having pu A drum puppies. A drum singing Toffee's album. Toffee's having puppies. Some people thought you were pregnant. Oh, that's so sweet. I'm 55. Yeah, um, other things, more bigger miracles have happened. Get it out, Mark. I love the way Jill Dyer thinks it's a drunk singing album. A drunk... Now, that's not a bad idea. Do you remember talking albums by the like of, likes of uh, Cook and Dudley Cook and, you know, yeah. we could do a drunk well, song. Just songs. do that. I might do drunk so songs. So I want to do the 80s workout with um, yeah. Dutch tits off. Nicky Evans, it's not merch, I'm afraid. Not merch, merch, merch. Not merch. Not merch, merch. Mark being on Loose Men. Only when I've got my pecs up. There's so many of the things that you are talking about that there are conversations about. Yeah. Things could be happening yeah. along some of the things that you want to be happening. So that is that's true. all good. That is all good. Um, Strictly. Not a bad one. Is it our renewal of our vows? Well, that's, that's happening. That's all what we're discussing tonight. But... Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Going to do America. Going to break America. I think well, if you hit 500 thumbs up, we might tell you. When we going to, when we travel, when we can all travel Mark again, we Monty really Don. do want to do vlogs Just in America. So you do that, Mark replacing Monty Don. I'd quite like oh, that. Oh, he'd be brilliant. I'd quite like that. Me and Toffee in the garden. I also think he should replace Mark Commode as yeah, a movie reviewer. I should be the, yeah, well, I, you know what? There could be news in that. He'd be there great. There could be news in that area too. Do you remember our conversation the other yeah. way? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Could be fun in that department. What we're trying to say to you is, tonight's news is the first of much news that's going to be coming your way. We've got a bit of news flow. But actually, the unusual oh, thing... Oh, they've hit 500, Oh, the unusual thing about this news that we're giving you 
is that there's three bits of good news. But the last bit of news is, is going to be really lovely yeah. for some of you. Yeah. A few of you. Yes. And really lovely for us too. Yes. Because it will be a two-way thing. Yeah. So. So should we, should we admit that a number of people have been on, on message here? That a number yes. of people are on it. A number of you have got it. Yeah. Because it's almost... Got the first bit. Yeah, yes. it's almost impossible to hide it, isn't yeah. it, in the world of online and what have you. And at the end of the day, I am starring opposite Han Angelina Jolie <laughs> in the next outing of Maleficent. <laughs> Why does no one believe me? It is the homeschooling book. We know that's the first okay, one. So that's and the we're first really excited so about that. So we're very that. excited about that. And it's, it's with a really good publisher, Hodder. Yeah, Hodder. And it's, it's going to be loads of stuff about our lives that you have not heard about. It's quite an emotional book. It's, it's going to be lots of stuff in it. It's a bit autobiographical for the two of us. Yeah. It's, it, it's stuff we've never talked about, actually. And we, how we're doing it is we're talking through stuff and Mark is writing so brilliantly. As you know, Mark is a writer and it's really fantastic. Mm. So that's the first that's bit the first of our part. news. So well done. Congratulations on all you who got that. Yeah. Second Did you just go to Google and search our names? Yeah. <laughs> Second bit of news is that our uh, that we're going to give. Okay, so in the next twenty four hours, you can pre order, mm -hmm. and ten people randomly picked who have pre ordered will get a free book sent to them with a personal message. You tell us whatever the message is, Ooh, and we'll just, we will we'll write just, it in. We'll just give you a personal we'll message. It. Now the weird thing is because you have to do it because of competition rules and stuff. Is that You'd have to pre-order the book, you'd have yeah. to buy the book, and then you can return it to Amazon yeah, so you would get we'll your money it. back. So that's the thing. So it would be a personal message. We could we could think of something to write, or if it's something very particular you'd like to write for a friend or something, we can do that. Now, the terms and conditions for all of this are going to be underneath this yeah. video, towards the end of this video. And now we're getting to the bit that we don't think... Anyone's ever done before. Any other YouTuber's done. No. Or anybody's done when they've announced a book. But if we're wrong... It's okay. We'll just be wrong yeah. and it doesn't matter. <laughs> but at the moment, we are thinking we probably are the only people that I think we might be, this. yeah. Does anyone remember something called the Daz advert? There's a logic to what we're talking about here. Does Who remembers anyone... the Daz? What happens in the Daz advert? What happens ads? in the Daz advert? They're still on. Are they still on? What yeah. happens what in the happens Daz, on Daz advert? Daz adults? Tell, tell us that. What happens in the Daz adverts? Yeah. What happens in the Daz adverts? Yes, Gabrielle, they do. Eh? What help? Right, so what happens yeah. in the Daz ads? Yeah, people remember them. Oh, yes, my daughter was in it. D -D oh, there you go. Doorstep challenge. Doorstep challenge. Ashley. So now we're getting, getting we're close. getting a bit closer. Getting close. We're getting a bit closer. So if you made it clear what's happening here, ten people. If you order from Amazon, there's a link tonight, and in the next twenty four hours, the first ten people will be randomly Not first, chosen. Randomly. No, randomly chosen to receive a personalised book from us. But, what can you, but, who can guess what we're going to do? Oh, 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 there's a number of the people. The Daz Dogs, I like that. Oh. No, we're not doing a cheesy sitcom. Oh. Has anyone guessed it? Heidi Lawrence. Yes, we will be delivering yeah. some of those books yeah. to your doorstep. Yeah. We will bring your book to you. We will sign it there for you. And, and if you social will distancing be, allows, I'll have a coffee with you. Yeah, and you will be included in our vlog. You yes. will be part of the family. Yes. And we want to yeah. about that. And in fact, we should then probably even maybe make even put more messages in the book once we're with them and just sign it all over and write all over it and all sorts of stuff like that. So do we so know if anybody has ever done that before? Has anyone ever done that? I don't think anyone has. Yay! This one, Trisha. That's what you said. Now, of course, there are some there are some limitations in this. However much I'd like to see, send give one to Peggy Ward in in San Francisco, we can't. Very it's unlikely. It's got to be in the UK. Very unlikely. It's going to have um, to be in the UK. We're going to have to be able to get there. Yeah, and of course, we won't be able to do it immediately because it will spend on social distancing and yeah. all of that. There are but so many we, mitigating yeah, circumstances. We will. But we are going to. So, so there you go. we're really excited. Of course, we're over the moon about our book, mm -hmm. but we're really over the moon also in meeting some of you and you being part of our vlog. Yeah. And part of our story with this yeah. book. 
which now, will be... Now, of course, it might not be that the book's appropriate to you because you might not have kids, but you want to meet us. Now, that'd be a curious one, but maybe you could buy it for someone and we could sign it for someone that you think yeah, you might. Now, you it's buy it for not, somebody else. Can we also stress, this is not a book advocating homeschooling for everyone. This is a book that f basically looks at the whole concept of education and learning. And in lockdown, people have been put under huge duress, and we think there are things that we've learned that could help others. Not necessarily to take their kids out of school even, but to just help them and help them think about what's best for their kids, isn't it? It's, it's... Oh, somebody just said, I've just pre-ordered, but I'm fine by Barris to, for you to come to my home, so not needed. Oh. We can meet you in a park. We can meet you elsewhere. We can meet you by the beach. We could meet you outside a pub. We, we're only going to come to your doorstep anyway, yeah, yeah. or you can meet us in a park. Yeah, yeah. Meet us anywhere. Of course, you can absolutely have the book and not us. No, you don't have to have us. <laughs> yeah, if we're a... I mean, if you, you just know, think, oh, God. And also, much. if, say, you, are, you win the doorstep challenge and you don't want to be in the vlog and you don't want to be filmed, you yeah. wouldn't have to be. We would just come privately and you wouldn't have to be in the vlog. And what's the name of the book? Honey, I homeschooled the kids. Yeah, like... Honey, very, very honey, clever I woman. the kids. Called Lexi Boosie. Yep. Came up with the title. Yep. Cracking. One of our Cracking fabulous title. agents, and we were so excited when yep. she came up with it. We were like, oh my God, that's a brilliant idea. Honey, I so, homeschool the kids. Yeah. That's so cool. So, a big shout out to our agents who are, yeah. we have been with just not so long, but they've just been amaz amazing. Amazing. Glean Futures and. But here's the thing, because. And we, Hodder Publishers. Yeah, and Hodder. Thank you so, so much, yeah. because. This, for us, to work on a book together as well, has been a dream for Oh, it's so been a dream. Long, it's it? also been what's distracted me meaningfully away from a lot of stuff that I've wanted to do, other, stuff, other things. But it's been, it's been so rewarding, and I'm so looking forward to you reading it. And I'm, I'm so looking forward to getting it out there. And I mean, uh, you're an English graduate. This would have been a dream of yours to write a book. That's absolutely so, lovely. Really so, and, and we know that you... And I think the thing is, is I think even if you don't want to homeschool, you haven't got kids, it is a story of the struggles of being a parent oh, yeah. and, and the like, you know, it's we're really honest about guide. it, it's where we've really gone wrong, lows, where we've messed yeah. up, what we've regretted, what we're, you know. And it's out on the, it's formally out on the 3rd of September, but all pre-orders are happening now on Amazon. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Monsieur Abigan. Thank you. Mark your hands. So what do you think? Do you think any other YouTubers have done this when they've pronounced the book? I think it might be a first. I think I it's might, a first. I think it might be a first. It will be released on September the 3rd, yeah. I think. But I think, did the books come out before then? I'm well, sure. you can pre-order, you can pre-order from now. So. Yeah, you can pre-order now, but I don't know exactly when And obviously this, this, this <coughs> bonus ball, of course... It's if only you, for if 24 hours, you have to pre-order. It's only for 24 hours, and of course if you order the book, you, don't, you can send the book back. What's the weird transaction? So, on? Just explain if you, that. So you, it's a bit complicated, so... The only way we can do it yeah. with terms and conditions of the competition is that you have to buy the book from Amazon. You have yeah. to pay for it. You have to, to enter the competition. Yeah, to enter the competition. If you were to win the competition in, in that you get a free book signed from us. And a coffee with me. And a coffee with me. You're allowed to return, return book. your app book to Amazon, the one yeah. that you bought, and get a full refund. Yeah. You might want two books. Yeah. You might want one for you and one for a yeah. friend or yeah. whatever. Yeah. Um, so, God, it's so hot. It's so hot. And the email and all the details of where you send your proof of purchase are beneath this video now. So you can go down there and you can, and you can find out that yeah. all the terms and conditions are down there. So, uh, yeah, just pre-ordered the hardcover and Kindle version. Do you know version. what? Do you know what? I, love I the to... cover. Oh, oh, thank you. We love the cover. Kiki took the photo. It was, yeah, and we love that Kiki took the photo. Yeah. So it's just like, no, yeah. no, no fancy the, photographers. There's homeschooling no... in action in the yeah, cover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. what I like. And the thing is, you guys know our girls. Yeah. You, know, you know so much about our girls and you care about right. our girls. And we, we, we see that a lot from you. So yeah. it's... And, and you know, a lot of you are really lovely about them and mm. say how talented they are. And sometimes when we're feeling, we've been feeling a bit low about Very our low. decisions yeah, yeah, yeah. of what we've done and you've... And you've said stuff, and it's like it's really spurred us on, hasn't it? Yeah, it really has. It really has. And, and we're and also aware that a lot of people follow us on here because either they were homeschooling mm. or they actually started to homeschool their kids. Yeah, but what absolutely. you said is a really good point. This can complement your Absolutely. Your this this is as much for parents coming out of lockdown who were thinking, do you know what? I was teased with a little bit of what I liked about homeschooling or just loosening their learning. But of course they go back to school. So this isn't about advocating everyone homeschools. No, it's, it's not about... right for everyone. No, 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 And absolutely. it's hard. But Jessica a... Atkins is a preschool teacher and I love the idea of school homeschooling. Can't wait to read oh, this book. Oh, well, brilliant. That's brilliant. Yeah. And, and we're very, it's, very, it's a very emotional read. 
It's a very it emotional read. Because it was interesting for us because we talk all about our school life and like, oh my God, the differences yeah, between yeah. Mark and I. Yeah. Our lives have just been so There's different. lots of insights it's into Nanny Dye, your parents, mm. and, uh, the decisions they made when we were younger. You know, and I know a lot of people have been quite hungry for sort of, uh, you know, stuff about that. So in, in the writing, we've really thought of you, you guys. You know, we've always, haven't we, in all discussions, we've been saying... We've got to make sure that we're thinking about, you know, what are our subs interested mm. in, and what 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 stuff are you guys going to mm. also find rewarding? So, um, mm. so yeah, there we go. Yeah, I feel, I feel and I, I'm really looking. I hope people. Should I bring my? I suppose depending on who wins, do I bring my own espresso machine? Or <laughs> do I get a takeout or what? Oh, thank you. Who just did that? Is there a waving Woodstock? thing? Oh my God! No, sorry, a waving I, thing. Yeah, who sorry, just did that? I think it was Jessica Woodstock. It was Jessica, Jessica Woodstock. for being you, Jessica. Naughty. Just ordered it. Just order the book. Oh, <laughs> and then you could I win. just got kids. Oh, um, Tracy Lindsay, my daughter would love it to be Maddie at Kiki at the door. Sorry, she'd shout for me if it was. She'd shout for me if it was you guys. <laughs> I'm sure we could have a chat with Maddie and Kiki about that. <laughs> got a question on your homeschooling. Do you worry about their socialising? All in the book. It's all, it's all in the book. All in the book. It's all in the book. Uh, socialising. Yeah. Right? But what I would say is, don't we as parents will worry about everything? Exactly. So... Yeah. There yeah. are different worries in different ways. You worry about the same things in different ways with homeschooling as well. And also the other misnomer about homeschooling is that you're constantly with your kids. It just doesn't work like that. So, you know, there are lots of myths punctured and there's lots of thoughts about why we have kids, teach kids and what it's all about. What yeah. is the gauge of success in our children's yeah. lives? We ask that question and it's a really... I think I, I think there's there's some really meaningful answers in there too. Yeah, and the thing is, it's like I always say to Mark, can, can you imagine through lockdown, every show, every new radio, yeah. every asks me to go on because I'm one of very very few people off the in telly the public eye, yeah. that that homeschool, and I've always said no. I I talked about it right at the beginning of the swim, but I always say no, mm. and and I'm really glad that I have because. And not with any plan of, like, I was going to write a book. I never knew we were going to write a book. Obviously, Mark writes most of it. I just talk it in. Um, but we, we, we ne I never knew when I said no. It was just like, I've always wanted to tell the story properly. And so mm. many people want to hear it in a different way. They yeah. want to put it through a magnifying glass. And yeah. so, yeah, you won't have heard. Yeah. You won't have heard. No. And it's funny, you isn't it? Because when you think how open we are with you here on YouTube yes. and how open I'm on Loose Swim for the last 20 years... You will be surprised how you haven't heard what well, and I was trying, 75% 75 of this book. To 80 We've never book. said any, any of it. And the reason for that, I think, is, is because I think we assume that it's potentially not, not mainstream enough, but not, you know, not something... Yeah. It's not something you can talk about freely or all the time, really, is it? So. Uh, well, no, it's, for me, it's not that. It's just I want to say it properly. And I yeah, want to say, yeah, got, it's not yeah. something you just want to skim over. Yeah. It's not something I want to go on... BBC Radio London yeah. and talk for three minutes or don't, you can't because it is just and I know it's an awful thing so it's such a journey mm. and we're looking forward the to thing. the press push on this because I tell you one of the things that I always find intriguing about this and I'm looking forward to backing you up a bit on this is that I do think journalists and people who cover this subject I, I know from the programs that, that programs that TV producers make and we've been asked to be in there is a preconceived prejudice about what homeschooling is. Yeah, so it's, it's going to be yeah. so much fun. Yeah, showing people the other side of it. Of course, you know you know our girls, and you know you know what they're like. Yeah. But you don't really know because we don't show you much about the actual homeschooling stuff. No, so no, absolutely. But we're so excited about meeting some of you. And I've just had a really self-interested thought. What? What if someone who wins is from Ireland and we can get there? <laughs> we can get to Ireland. <laughs> That'd be so exciting. Claude up Egan, thank you, my darling. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Um, so just to reiterate, Deborah Freeman, if I people... could have turned back time, I'd have homeschooled. Really? Isn't that interesting? Well, I think it would be interesting for you to read the book then as well, because you might be in two minds one way or the other. You might think, oh, no, it probably wouldn't have been for me. Yeah, yeah. Or, you know. But I promise so... you, there is something to take thank out for you, everyone. Gemma. For everyone who either has children or has uh, grandchildren or has relatives or... Just if you just want to shake up your approach to schooling. Mm. It's, it's Maria a... H, I've always wondered what it's like homeschooling. I think I would have loved it. Yay. I think this is it. I think, I remember once somebody saying to me, was it you, Michelle? Michelle, you know, Michelle, who looks after us. I think Michelle once did, a, 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 when we first met Michelle and she was doing this sort of search on all the sort of stuff mm. I'd ever been on. And she said that over all the years I've been on Loose Women, mm. 
20, over 20 years on and off, it was the thing that got the most interest or the most hits mm. because people are, was when I spoke about homeschooling because people are so interested because it's like us before we went into it it's such an unknown world isn't yeah. it it's like well, what is nobody knows anything about yeah. it so and there's no other book like it yeah and that's what we uh, love about it purple snowdrop by homeschool my kids people are saying a book tour in yes, a weird way do. we're offering a doorstep mini book tour aren't we of of the top winners or yeah we winners. would love to do a bit of yeah. a book tour yeah we would yeah but i don't want to do one of those where you have to turn up and then there's a table and chair. xander gibbs says camper van book, book tour camper van, camper van book, book tour is a great like idea that. that's a good idea just very free and easy not you've yeah. just got to turn up and wait yeah, and yeah. stand at a table it's really yeah. really cringe that we yeah, need yeah, to do that absolutely <laughs> Well, there you go, guys. There you go. So all oh, the... so many people have yeah, ordered. I've seen so loads of you have. Yeah. I am so chuffed that you are on board with us. Um, and, yeah, chuffed to bits. Really chuffed to bits that I can see that lots of you are really interested yeah. in it. Um, yeah, so uh, you guys should be coming to me in Zurich or Vienna. I'm not a parent and I'm single, but I plan to be a mother in the next three or four years. Oh, and wow, I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. Yeah, so the book will be interesting for yeah, you, I think. Yeah, I think absolutely. I think for teachers it will be really interesting as well because, again, some of the philosophies maybe could be incorporated with yeah. your, in your day-to-day. -day. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, and thanks. this one has worked so oh, bloody yeah. hard. <laughs> I'm so proud of him. Yeah, Jesus good. Christ. Yeah. It's 50,000 words. It's a lot of words. 50,000 words. <laughs> Let me just say that again. 50,000 words. <laughs> um, so, no, oh, so we're so hard. glad we've to share it with you. It. We've worked hard for it. And, so and, glad and, to share uh, it. Yeah, so I hope you enjoy it. And all the details will come to you in, um, what's that? You can also get it in Waterstones if you don't like Amazon, apparently. Oh, um, okay. And, and that would still be considered a pre-order. I don't know if that works Let with me the... Let have a look. I don't know if that works with the... Does Let that work as a pre-order for the competition? I don't know. Let me just check. We're just checking the terms on that. But all the details, re who you send your proof of purchase to and everything will be below and then it will be chosen at random in a sort of, I guess, one of those kind of bally things like the National Lottery. Um, so thank you guys, thank you. And you know what? We feel so supported by you guys. You know, we we hear and um, thanks, Sandra. We hear thanks, Tracy, Lindsay, Suzanne Stone. Um, yes, yeah, Suzanne Stone, take a breather, absolutely. Um, it, you know, we Just feel we feel very very supported by you guys. We really do. We know that there's a core of you who are out there. You get what we do. You like what we do. And you understand, you're part, you are genuinely part of all of our thinking and all of our thoughts around what we're doing. All these, all these sort of... I mean, platforms. my God, if you knew how much we talked about you, yeah. you'd go, it's what funny, do you think? It? Do you think they're like this? Or do you yeah, think they're like, like that? that? Do you yeah, think yeah. we should be thinking now about when, when, you know, as lockdown's coming out, what differently they might like yeah, from the cooking about what or we from the morning, yeah. morning thing? You know, and so, and so, you know, when we were asked whether we'd like to do this book, we really did sit down and have a conversation about yeah, yeah. how, what the subs would yeah. feel like and what you've said to yeah. us in the past. So, um, yeah. proof of purchase, I'm not tracking purchase. We will ask yes. That, yes, so if you do buy from, from Waterstones, Waterstones you, can you would still be part of the competition. Yeah, you, you just have to have proof of purchase. Just go to the details as to where to send it. But, um, but yeah, as Nadia says, as Nadia says, it, you know, when we have these discussions with, with the publishers and everything, we're talking, obviously, there's a direct sort of potential audience for a book about homeschooling. But there's also what is this going to say and how does this chime with, with all of you guys who, who are part of the family? Yeah. And so why when it's recently we've had to like cancel things Love and, move too, things and move things around, it's because we've been doing a lot of work yeah, on yeah, the book. So yeah. there will be a bit of that, a bit of changing and shifting. Oh yeah. So where you got maybe got a couple do. of nights where suddenly it was like a strident, we're going to have to cancel. <laughs> there was just a few things going on at that time. So yeah. Um, Oh, that's nice. Sophie J. Matilda, sorry to go oh. off topic, but she loved you on the sober session. Here's a thought. Look, Brenda in PA, I'm in the States. So if I win, positive thinking, we could meet by, via Skype or SK6. Or why, not? why not? That's a good why idea. Not? That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Why don't, why don't, we, why don't we say that, you know, yeah. the top five we will and the other five we'll, we'll, do, we'll do virtually? Yeah, if they're people too far away. Well, yeah, they might yeah. not all be too far they away. They might not all be too far away. In which case, we'll <laughs> see you all. I tell you what, I'm really looking forward to my espressos with you all. And I want <laughs> selfies with each and every one of you. I just, I just think, and remember, you don't have to be in the vlog, but I think it'd be so nice to meet people and put them in the vlog. It'd be so nice. Yeah, if, yeah. If, if, only if you want to, obviously. Only if you want to. I mean, we could do something really stupid. You could do line dancing with me or something. <laughs> great fun. I'm great fun. Really am. I hear. I'm also very annoying. Very annoying. 
But if you do the squat, I might Shout put the Shout out for Caroline Dodsworth. I couldn't do my squats today. It was too hot. It's because you keep farting. Hi, Jordan O'Sullivan. No, Thank I, you. Yeah. Um, Vicky Austin, Gemma, I would love to have a meet with everyone. Oh. Jordan O'Sullivan. Hello and welcome. And... <laughs> well, Holly, if I win, I promise I won't talk about immunology. We love you talking about immunology. Yeah. Vicky Austin, um, I haven't Gemma. seen Leo. Where's Leo? Oh, that's weird, because she was Leo. on the Instagram, yeah, yeah, wasn't yeah, yeah. she? Leo, Leo, Leo. Oh, there um, she is. There she Mark, is. Mine's a frappy wappy woo. <laughs> hey. So, uh, don't forget, it is... Um, you are a... 24 rabid, hours. You are a rabid tortoise. <laughs> oh, that's my sushi. Oh, uh, having, he's having sushi to celebrate. <laughs> Thank you, all of you. I can see lots of you have pre-ordered. Thank you for being part. It was like three little surprises. It was good, huh? Anyway, we love you all very much. And thank you to Gleam and thank you to Hodder. Bye, everybody. Oh, can I say a quick hello to Sub? Homeschool. Da 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 da. Looking like a jazz singer. She does. Yeah. Maddie, you've got to wear that for one of your Insta gigs. And, oh, and by the way, if, if you feel that the linchpin key in any of your homeschooling is me and Nadia doing the teaching, we could come along. <laughs> we, we, we could come along. <laughs> Bye, guys. Lots Thanks of love. so much. Lots, Lots of, love. of love. Take Bye. care. And we'll be Bye. putting lots of details on all our Instagram and all that sort of malarkey. Bye. Bye.